Well, this is a bit of a fast blast for uh, which is going to a wonderful thing. It's going to the first AV, the first AV conference uh, in a long time. Alternative view. It's actually AV thirteen. Uh, a and R Crane founded the uh, Alternative View conferences, and uh, the good old days. Uh, they used to publish these wonderful had these notes. And this is packed full of notes, and um, it's been well used. And Ian isn't with us anymore, which is very sad. But it's really good that the team at the Alternative View, and also which includes some good people at the UK column, are actually getting the um, getting the conference back on track. That's that's really good news. Uh, so this is just a fast blast on a Saturday morning. Uh, my own conferences are happening. That's to say uh, the uh, BASIS project, as BASIS 2023 Christmas Seminars. That's got Michael Shrimpton who's going to, and that's December the 9th uh, in Blueberry Hall in Pusey. Um, and uh, that will be um, the speakers I've got on the left or the right. I'll put on a quick list there michael shrimpton sandy adams uh, bob osborne who has published a fantastic book on zenner and the incredibly uh, charismatic and important differences of um, ca characters uh, involved there and it's he'll be uh, answering questions on that and then we have lucy wyatt and she's got two two or two two bites at the cherry so that will be all day from nine o'clock till seven thirty uh, at Bouverie Hall uh, in Pusey, and there's a train station there. And you also get there by bus. So we do want to end on time so people who can get buses and trains can can get away and things. We'll try some kind of a Christmas dinner, but it's very difficult to organise these things. The local pub is no longer there either, and so it's very difficult to get things sorted that way. Maybe people will get something organised in the one from nearby town of Devizes, or we'll crash out in the Indian. Anyway, that is the uh, really, really very critical conference. Michael Shrimpton talked about the uh, real military issues involved behind the Ukraine thing. As far as we can say, uh, Bob Osborne talked about the intricate, based on your questions, it's a, little, a lot of artists have been in uh, Zenner, but also very crucially uh, people going back to, to the 1850s, um, uh, the Huxley's, the Fabian agenda. The Fabian agenda is, of course, to make humanity into cyborgs. There's a lot of people who disagree with that. All things, are, a lot of things are changing. Uh, we've uh, just done a number of uh, scans with Miriam of a number of uh, facilities which formerly contained a lot of ETs. And going back to uh, the 60s, 70s, 80s, 90s, that sort of thing, we had a lot of greys and reptilians there, Alpha Draconis and stuff like that, deep in the underground tunnels. Uh, witnesses have uh, talked about that but things changed around about uh, 2007 and that's of course when I was involved with a really big fight with the Chinese uh, and various other third parties involving AI and the takeover of uh, the global media which is uh, a situation very close it was great to watch Andrew Bridgen um, absolutely brilliant to stand up in Parliament practically on his own I have to salute uh, Danny Kruger, who's the who's the MP here uh, in Devizes, he was there and he stood up. That's a big plus. He's got my vote next time. Really, at this stage, it doesn't matter which political party that you're that you're supporting. It's down to whether uh, the people you vote for are actually going to help save humanity because we've got so much of a compromised situation. There are uh, other commentators like Kimberly Guggen who have been making a lot of really deep stuff on that. Uh, a lot of people have left. Uh, we're in a different age. We'll have to see how well that goes. But it's up to you, any, every individual, individual person to uh, get on with that individually in your own particular way to help hum humanity and l unite with life on this planet. It's wonderful the way uh, we can have interaction with animals. And nature itself and that's what we need to really focus on i'll also be doing uh very soon i think november the 4th the origins conference i'll be involved with that with hugh newman that's at the same hall the very hall and that's uh, a lot of work to do on that and we're ripping this place apart 
we've decided that uh, these desks that we've got here uh, are office desks. They're not really suitable for editing on. They're the wrong height. And it's certainly given me a couple of back problems over the years because you're not sitting properly at these things. So if you want a couple of office desks with the corners cut off them, uh, these things, you, know, you can't see. So that's, I think, about it. Now we have a second bases thing. It's organised by Josie from Ireland. And they're coming over to Glastonbury, and that's at the tannery, the following weekend. I think that's December 16th and 17th in Glastonbury. They're going to be doing a lot of field work uh, on the Saturday. And then I'll be speaking with Sandy Adams and, uh, who's a, and also Berea Wheatley and Bob Osborne on the Sunday afternoon. So we'll run off some talks on that. And that's at the tannery, I believe, in Glastonbury as well. So that's on a separate site. And I'll put up those details on screen, hopefully. And uh, we'll just say... Hello and a uh, big shout out to the Alternative View people. Um, big that they've got back on track during a live conference. Normally it would be three days plus a day of seminars. Uh, but that's a big deal and um, I have really support Ian R. Crane's work and it was tremendous, I think almost 20 years of conferences and um, there's a few gaps in between. But um, Ian... Um, stood his ground and went through ter terrible suffering and operations during the COVID emergency with an empty hospital an empty hospital only eight patients he was one of them and that's why he got such great attention it only gave him another six months but it gave him showed his fight and his fortitude uh, as he as he took his path to other places that's it for now